This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Saturday, February 4th. A fire broke out aboard Viking Orion while it was docked in Sydney, Australia on Friday, causing 850 people to evacuate. Early reports indicate it was electrical, possibly from a corded device in a guest cabin over on Deck 5. The ship's crew extinguished the fire quickly with help from the local fire service and no injuries were reported. The 14-day voyage out of Sydney was not impacted by the incident. And Princess Cruise has announced details on its upcoming ship, Sun Princess, which will be the largest ship in the Lions fleet. A first for Princess, the Horizons Dining Room will span three decks, each floor having its own dining experience. The theater on board will be called Princess Arena, featuring an in-the-round concept with the capacity to hold over 1,000 guests. And the popular Alfredo's Pizzeria venue will include a new open mouth pizza oven that reaches 968 degrees. The ship will also feature one of Princess Cruz's largest casinos ever. The 4,000 guest Sun Princess is currently under construction in Italy and is set to debut next year. And earlier this week, the Juno Assembly in Alaska approved a list of policy changes concerning tourism. The objectives include limiting cruise ships to five per day and adding electricity capability to the cruise ship docks. Some Juno residents want the limits on cruise ships to be even tighter, suggesting only three or four ships be allowed to dock at one time. However, the city would likely face legal opposition if it tried to enforce that type of cap. And cruise line stocks were down on Friday. Carnival Corporation down 2%, 11.80. Royal Caribbean down 1.3%, 68.44. And Norwegian down 3.2%, 16.57. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. Have yourself a beautiful Saturday. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Do you have a story or a tip to report? Let us know. Email tips at cruiseradio.net.